Welcome back. Ariana Moyer joins us once again here at the news desk. She's got the top three trending things on EerieNewsNow.com. Yeah, so we're going to talk about that construction scam in Crawford County that Elspeth talked about last night on here. Then we have City Council that's going to be meeting in community centers from some upcoming meetings and then some PennDOT projects that are going on around the area. So yesterday, Elspeth Meisner came onto the show to kind of talk about a woman in Crawford County, Debbie Dell, who went through this two-year process of trying to get her home renovated after her kiddos moved out, all that stuff. She met with several contractors, and she felt like this one, Chad Eckenrode, was the best after doing some research, seeing how he seemed very personable with her, measuring things in her home, etc., cetera, um, only to find out that he has done several kind of construction contractor-based scams in the past and left her high and dry after asking her to turn off of her uh, electricity for the home. And it is just, it's been a very lengthy process for her. And I went through and read some of the comments on Elsbeth's post. And people said that this is something very common, not just with him specifically, but other contractors in general. So And this family dotted its I's and crossed yes, its exactly. T's. It did everything right. And still. And still. So check out her part two story about kind of what to do with the Better Business Bureau. But very sad that happened. There is a GoFundMe called Rebuilding Our Parents Shattered Dream if you do want to assist. Moving on, last night by a unanimous vote, Erie City Council members passed a resolution put forward by Councilman Chuck Nelson to have council meetings in June, July, and August at local community centers. So June 19th, they're going to be meeting at the Booker T. Washington Center, and the exec executive director said that it's great because the kids can really see and get involved in their community. And last but not least, PennDOT is picking up some projects this summer. The 2024 construction season has begun, and so they're inviting people for a public displays plan for the East Bayfront Parkway project, and they are resuming construction on Zuck Road in Mill Creek as well. That's a $7.8 million renovation project there. Always good to get people's comments. Yes.